to speak about Tangaging. This tutorial video will be long a little bit, but I'm sure you will have very useful technical information. Tangaging means liquid measurement in large storage tanks to determine product volume. Tank gauging system ensures accurate level, pressure, and temperature measurements for oil movement, inventory control, and overfill prevention, securing efficient operations. Now, let's have more technical details focusing on RTG rather than gauging. Let's go! Where is tank gauging used? Petrochemical industry, distribution terminals, pipeline terminals, air fueling storage at airports, refineries, fuel depots, in addition to chemical storage. Storage tanks are often placed in clusters or tank farms. The tanks are atmospheric, pressurized or cryogenic. Atmospheric tanks are vertical cylinders with various roof designs. Most common are Fixed roof tanks, either cone roof or dome roof tanks. In a fixed roof tank there is a vapor space between the liquid surface and the external roof. Floating roof tanks with various designs. In a floating roof tank the liquid surface is covered by either an internal or an external floating roof. Pressurized tanks are often of spherical or horizontal cylinder design. Pressurized tanks normally require automatic tank gauging in a still pipe. The purpose of tank gauging. The main purpose of the system architecture of a tank gauging system is to route the tank information from the tank farm to the users in a fast and reliable manner. Tank gauging system measures and calculates tank data for custody transfer, inventory management, product movement, mass balance, and loss control, as well as leak detection and overfill prevention. Tank gauging techniques. Tank gauging has a long history. Since each user and every application has its own specific requirements, several measurement techniques and solutions to gauge tank contents are currently available as the following. Manual gauging, float and tape gauges, servo gauges, radar gauges. Radar tank gauging. The use of radar to measure product levels in storage tanks is one of the most recent techniques. Radar level gauges do not have moving parts and only an antenna is required in the tank and requires no regular maintenance. Radar devices require no direct contact with the liquid. This makes it possible to use a radar gauge on a wide variety of liquids from heated heavy asphalt to cryogenic liquefied gases like liquefied natural gas (LNG). The radar instruments use microwaves, generally in the 10 GHz range, for the measurement of the liquid level. The distance the signal has traveled is calculated from a comparison of transmitted and reflected signals. Different types of radar gauges. There are many radar level gauges on the market. Several are made for process applications where high accuracy and stability are not the primary requirements. For tank gauging applications, the reliability of the gauging and the accuracy performance are the primary qualities. To meet the requirements it is important to select the optimal antenna design and the right microwave frequency. When using still pipes as wave guides it turns out that frequencies in the X-band are optimal. Fixed roof storage tanks without still pipes often have tank apertures in sizes 200 to 600 mm, 8 to 24 inches, in diameter. Suitable antennas for such openings are those that can handle heavy water condensation and dirt buildup. Horn antenna gauge, is designed for easy mounting on 200 mm, 8 inch, or larger nozzles on tanks with fixed roofs. Parabolic antenna gauge, is designed for mounting on tanks with fixed roofs, this design of the parabolic antenna gives extreme tolerance against sticky and condensing products. Still pipe gauge, 
is used on tanks with still pipes and with all products suitable for still pipes such as crude oil, gasoline etc. It transmits radar waves from a cone-shaped antenna towards the liquid surface inside the pipe. The still pipe can be mounted in a tank with an external or internal floating roof or on a fixed roof tank, for level measurement of liquefied gas in LPG or LNG tanks. Tank Gauging System Overview, Using Radar Tank Gauging System, From Level Measurement to Computer Software Hybrid Tank Gauging System The name, Hybrid Tank Gauging System, comes from the fact that it is a combination of a traditional tank gauging system and a hydrostatic tank gauging HTG, system. There are two main use cases for a hybrid system where the user is interested in either mass or density, or both. Most hybrid system users in the petroleum industry are interested in measuring density online since the calculation of transferred volume, standard volume, requires measurement of level, temperature, and density. The hybrid system makes it possible to avoid manual density measurement on tanks, which is a labor-intensive task and is often related to serious measurement errors if not done properly. To be able to calculate density, a hybrid system therefore has one pressure sensor if the tank has atmospheric pressure, and two pressure, P1, P3, sensors if the tank is not freely ventilated. Custody Transfer and Inventory Tank Gauging The tank gauging configuration system is used for the highest demands on accurate measurements for inventory management and custody transfer. Precise net volumes are calculated using tank strapping tables and compensation for temperature and tank characteristics. All values are transferred to the master software, which has a complete set of inventory and custody transfer functions. The software includes an API-ISO calculator for volume and density. Alternatively, inventory data can be transferred directly from the system hub to the DCS without going via software. Worldwide and top automatic tank gauging systems manufacturers and suppliers. Motherwell Tank Gauging. Rosemount Tank Gauging. Honeywell, NRAF Tank System, Endress and Hauser. If you like this video please subscribe this channel and press bell icon to get notification of new videos. Thank you so much for watching and have a nice day.